Our top story this lunchtime, Korea's science and culture ministries say they will seek to help the government realize its vision for achieving a smart information society through ICT innovation. The ministries laid out their plans for the new year. In a briefing for the acting president and prime minister, Kim Jeon starts us off. Five government offices, including the Ministry of Science, ICT and Future Planning, have outlined their action plans for the year for acting president and prime minister Hwang Kyo-an. In a briefing Friday, the officials said their focus will be on bolstering the government's growth initiatives and its vision of achieving a smart information society through ICT innovation. The ministries also pledged to work toward creating a healthy startup ecosystem through the expansion of the government's creative economy initiative. Other steps include increasing Korea's ICT competitiveness on the global stage by making policies focused on meeting researchers' needs, creating new markets and services through convergence and innovation, and supporting state projects involving smart IT to better prepare for the so-called fourth industrial revolution. To do that, the science ministry says it will increase the amount of research and development funding for basic science to more than 738 million U.S. dollars this year. It will also provide research funds of up to $25.2 million per person for 1,000 young scientists this year. The ministry also designated 10 sectors, including the Internet of Things, smart cars and artificial intelligence, that it will seek to aid in generating business opportunities and profits and creating new services and markets. In particular, it aims to promote the commercialization of the fifth-generation LTE Internet connectivity by 2020. It will also increase development in the field of new medicine and the biosector to more than $106.9 million this year. Kim Jian. Arirang News.